Welcome to episode 7 of Real It In. I'm Cole, let's talk movies. Ready to say goodbye to Quibi? The $2 billion short form mobile streaming service was hailed as the next step forward in entertainment. It's shutting down after a record shattering 6 months, making it the shortest lived streaming service of all time. The company was plagued with low subscriber numbers which may have been due to the pandemic or the general lack of interest in the concept. I personally enjoyed some of the stuff they had, but I always felt like it would have been better if they weren't so short. Each Quibi was under 10 minutes, which made it a pain to binge an entire series. Hey, at least they stuck with their plan on keeping things short. There aren't any new movies for me to cover this week, so I'll move on to the Golden Seal of Approval. This week I watched 7 movies. In terms of my scoring, this week is by far the lowest out of every episode today, with a disappointing average of a 5.71. Out of 220 films this year, I've only given a perfect score to one comedy, 21 Jump Street. Joining the club of perfect 10s is 2008's Tropic Thunder. What makes both of these movies so fantastic is that they lampoon the current state of Hollywood, have something important to say, and are absolutely hilarious. Tropic Thunder is an enjoyable if you're an avid movie fan or a casual watcher looking for a laugh. Ben Stiller, Robert Downey Jr., and Jack Black are all completely stellar, and one secret actor will absolutely blow your mind at the end. That's all for this week's movie news. Have a fantastic Friday and a wonderful weekend. Stay fresh, Wildcats. <laughs>